And it's also good to distinguish between these two curves using a legend and the command to do that is legend. So if I come in here and say help legend, I will get some quick help on it. There are different ways to get help. And so I can see it, it tells me how to add a legend. So it's just string one, string two, string three, and so on. So in this case, we need two strings, one for the first curve and the other for the second curve. So I'll come in here and I'll say legend. So the first string is, um, I'll call it Euler's method without uh, apostrophe S for now. I'll show you a trick to include the apostrophe S. And then I'll call the second curve analytical sol. and F5 to run it. And so you see it added the legend, and if I maximize it, I see that uh, I may want to replace, uh, you know, relocate where the legend is. I might also want to play with the, the axis settings. And you can control the location of the legend if you had, to, if you look at the help, um, this is how you control the location of the legend. So you give, you say location, and if I say north, it'll put it around here. Okay, you see that uh, changed the location of the legend and centered it a little bit more. And I might want to um, also change my axis limits to um, so that the legend doesn't run into the curve when I you know when, when I maximize it.